Welcome back, boys and girls, to more Sunset Overdrive. I do hope you're enjoying the series so far, and I'm having a ton of fun with this game. Probably one of my favorite ones of recent times. And in the last part, we found some incriminating evidence that Troop Master Norton is in fact a scumbag who is hiding Master Brocream, or at least has some knowledge of his disappearance that he is not willing to share. Sounds like a culprit to me, but we are going to find out right now. I am headed to Hellcat's Diner to meet Sam, who told me that 4 Kim is in trouble, and I must hurry over there to see what's going on. So, I am bouncing and grinding my way over there, and hopefully I can get there pretty quickly and receive these dire news. Getting these badges here is pretty good. can upgrade my uh, overdrives later on. I think we're going to grab this neon sign over here, since it's conveniently in front of me. I don't know, sometimes you go through it and you don't grab it, and other times you do. I'm still trying to figure that out. We'll see, though. Blow up some of these OD, and there's a fizzy balloon over here. I'm not going to bother with it. Not going to bother with it. I'll get that at a later time. Alright, and there is Hellcat's Diner. Never been there, but that's a cat, and he looked like a Hellcat. And there's Sam. Up here. Oh, and I missed the ledge, like a baboon. Forkim just left. She said those smoke signals at the train station could be grill cranes. But I saw a bunch of scabs going after her. You gotta get up there. Wait here. Okay, so Forkim was at the train station, but she may be in danger. I'm gonna go find her. Gonna go save her. She needs some saving. And that's what I'm here for. Him, but her phone is dead. Oh, I hope she's okay. She probably turned her phone off. Either that or she's sick of your constant texting. Did she at least go armed? She's always prepared. She had a baseball bat and a book on how to tie knots. Clever girl. Okay, so the train station's here somewhere. Actually, I think I am in it right now as we speak. Blow up some of these scabs. Apparently, it's very well fortified over here. These are some very wide escalators. I don't know if you guys noticed that. I just now realized they're escalators because they're so wide. Escalators should not be that wide. I don't know what I'm shooting at. I'm just shooting in that general direction. Oh, there's some turrets down there. That could be some danger. Blow it up before it blows me up. And then there's a bunch of scabs around here. And then there's that one guy. There's a couple more. They keep coming up. I'm gonna blow them up since I can't get them with my machine gun. I'm just gonna keep going ahead. I'm gonna forge onwards. Okay, so we know that Forkim is alright, which is good news. She seems to know what she's doing. She's being a ninja assassin or whatever. And just trying to find out what happened to Brill Cree. She said she was going to check out the train. I haven't heard from her since. She's probably dead. I guess there's a chance she's still alive. But I won't know until I get up to the platform. And get up there! Hurry! Okay, and... Here I am with the trains. Let's see what's going on. Get her on the train and don't hurt her. He'll run her alive. Uh, Brill cream's not here. It's a trap. Ah, uh, so it looks like they're made off with my buddy. They've kidnapped Fork him. That's not okay with me, so I'm gonna chase this train down. Screw this train. I'm gonna try to blast those engines. Okay. Carry 
I don't know, it's like shooting mines at me, man. There's a turret down there. It's got those boosters on the back. I'm gonna shoot him down. I'm gonna shoot everything. I'm not letting this train get away. I gotta save Fork him. Fate of Sunset City rests in my hands. Or I should say, at the end of the barrel of my Dirty Harry. Come on, Mr. Harry. It's me and you. And this train. And that turret. And all these OD. And my lack of health. And my eventual doom. There it is. That was the eventual doom I was talking about. I didn't expect it was going to come so soon after I said it. But there it goes. I died. Um... That's going to have to be alright. I'm going to have to keep uh, forging ahead. I need to get up there. I don't know if there's like a time limit on this. If you lose track of the train. I don't know. I don't want to lose it, though. Alright, here we go. Back on the railroad. Let me bust out these turbines. Or engines. Whatever these are. Boosters. And I fell. I fell! Oh my god. This video's a disaster so far. Two deaths. Two deaths, one video. So I've brought it to a halt, and what's up here? Sounds like a commotion. No more. Nice. Interrogation ass kicking. The is in a garbage truck, but they didn't garbage know where. Truck, huh? Man, the whole garbage system is automated. The trucks are equipped with GPS transmitters. If you come back to our base, I might be able to figure out a way to track it down. Okay, cool. I'm on my way. Wait, how do we communicate with Sam when neither of us is holding a phone? Uh, you know, technology. Technology. Let's not complicate things by poking holes in the way we deliver the story, okay? Oh, okay then. I'm gonna go back to the base and be magically gone by the time you have control. Fine by me. That's not weird at all. Okay, of course, do not mess with 4 Kim. Apparently, she's a badass. That's cool. Got new quests unlocked. And Floyd looks like he set up a new base. If you want some toilet paper? I have plenty of that. I'm actually gonna... Mm, let me take a look at this map. Several side quests I can do. Uh, there's one over here. I'll, I'll do that one, I guess. And I guess I'll fast travel over there. I learned a few other things while I was interrogating those scabs. They said they were working with Norton. He was supplied. And my fast travel cut off the conversation. Basically hung up in her face. And I'll never know what she had to say now. I'm sorry about that, guys. That was unintentional. Okay, let's do the side mission and get some extra goodies, extra rewards. Hey, I need to work on my maritime badges and scabs on the whole waterfront. Can you run them out of there? Permanently? You know about scabs. You get rid of them, and the next day, they've all just respawned. Unless... <laughs> okay, I got an idea. I love that dude. He's just like this huge buffed up dude with like tiny little short shorts. It looks so dweeby. Okay, so I need to go 500 meters that way and kill a Herker. In specific, a really ugly one. And I thought they were all pretty hideous, but apparently there's a special breed of Herkers that are extra ugly. About to find out. Got my dirty Harry ready to blow his brains out. It's 
so much faster to move through the city with the air dash unlocked. This is very smooth traveling in this game. It's really fun. Who needs a car, man? Who needs a car when you can just be a ninja? And apparently up there is where I'm going to find the Herker. Or there he is. Looks like any regular Herker to me. Use the flaming compensator and dirty hairy combo as always. It's the best way to kill these guys. He is pissed off. He's like throwing things everywhere. He's pissed. He doesn't want to die. I don't blame him, but he's dead now. Alright, so now apparently I have to decapitate the poor guy. There it is. That's his head. Now I need to go to the waterfront where the scabs are, so let me make my way over that direction. And I don't see where this is going. Is she gonna, like, throw the head at the scabs and scare them, or... What's going on? I don't know. We're gonna find out. Got some good real estate here by the oceanfront. Pretty nice. I'd love to live there. What is going on here? What? So I guess I have to scare them by pretending to be a Herker? I guess even if they don't think I'm a Herker, this is still pretty disturbing. Some skinny black girl in her underwear with a giant troll mask. Just dripping blood everywhere. It's pretty terrifying. I'd be pretty scared. I'd shit myself. Just gonna say it right now. So I guess I just run around with this mask on and kill these scabs, and that raises the scared meter. They're pretty scared, they're screaming all over the place. As they should be. Fear my Roman candle and my melee. And my acid sprinklers of doom. Fear them. Roman Candle is actually pretty good against the scabs. Roman Candle works very well against the scabs and the OD, which makes it a very good weapon for when you have a lot of enemies just clumped around, coming from different directions, and you don't know what you're going to be dealing with. It's a good little machine gun type weapon. These people are terrified. So the plan is working perfectly, it looks like. I like the little noises the character makes with the mask. It's pretty funny. Right, I don't want to die. I'm almost there. That would suck to die after coming so far. And I'm out of ammo. Let me get my Roman candle out. Blow these guys up. Finish off the job. Scared meter is almost full. Just need maybe one more kill. There we go. Run, fools! Fear me. You scared them all away. They're never coming back after that. Thank you so much. Hey, sure thing. It was fun. And look at this guy. He like glitched out behind me. Cool. Fun little side mission, and apparently all these OD think I'm Mama now, so they all came a running. I'm just gonna sprinkle some acid down there and let them kill themselves. And what is this? It's not like my Y button pop up over there. I don't know. 
and get my high fidelity. Oh, there's so many of them. They're just cowering around me. It's a Herker. Flame Compensator him. No dirty hairy ammo. T and Teddy ought to do it though. Let's blast him. One more hit. Come on. I can't see what's going on. There we go. I don't know why I'm sitting here fighting these guys. I could just leave. I could just leave, but I'm not going to. Uh, anyways, I saw my button like flash up around here. Let's deface Ed. Okay, so she's like a rebel. She wants to graffiti all over the city. That's cool. Alright, and I'm just gonna go back to the main storyline area, I suppose. I guess I can fast travel over there. Make things easier, faster. Fast travel diner. Bonk. Here I am, like magic. Like magic, I'm over here. And I am ready to talk to Floyd and test out this new base. That should be pretty fun. Pretty excited about it. Uh, there's also some optional side missions to do here, so maybe I'll do those. Uh, guys, I hope you're enjoying the series. Be sure to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next time.